I just don't know how to feel about this video today. Welcome back. My name is Mac. If you are new here, thank you so much for clicking on this video. It's a bittersweet video today. I'm just gonna warn you. I don't know whether I should be screaming from the rooftops or crying or, you know, sending someone to jail because this is the last Whitney collection. I just don't know what to do. However, we're gonna stick to the positives. We're not here to be negative. This collection that Whitney has created for the fifth time, absolutely stunning, marvelous, immaculate, pure slay. I don't even know what to say. When I tried on these pieces, my jaw literally dropped babes to the floor. When it came to receiving my package, there were some technical difficulties. I don't know what happened. We did get lost in translation a few times, but it's fine. We secured the goods, which is why I'm literally posting this YouTube video hours before launch. It is January 18th today. I have an appointment in one hour, so we gotta... We gotta get this rolling. I'm gonna try to post this for you guys today, okay? I'm committed to getting this to you before the launch happens so that you have all the tea. This collection is launching Thursday, January 19th at 8 a.m. PT time. I will be leaving all the other time zones down below for you. This collection speaks all sorts of volumes, okay? I don't even know like where to start. Very different from the previous collections we've seen from Whitney before. However, I will say there is a lot of familiar aspects that she did include into this collection, such as the same buttery soft material along with the same butt scrunch. I would say there's more new aspects to this collection than there is old. That makes sense. When it comes to sizing throughout this collection, stick to your original size. So whatever you've purchased previously from Whitney's collections, I would carry that through to this collection. When in doubt, I would say you could size down with this just because it is buttery soft. She's really stretchy. So there is room to size down if you please. There are also six beautiful new colors coming out that we have yet to be seen with Whitney's previous collections and Gymshark for that matter. We've got Canyon Red. She's spicy, okay? She's actually sitting right here. You can kind of see her. We got a staple pristine black, skylight white, cement. All right, Um, I don't know what happened with my camera and why she keeps suddenly stopping on me while I'm trying to record. So I've moved to my iPhone and I'm so sorry about this, but I am determined to serve you guys with all the info so that you are nice and prepared for tomorrow's launch. As I was saying, I think I finished off at cement. We also have petal press pink, which I actually don't have any petal press pink with me, but stunning color, take my word for it. And then we have this lovely leaf green. I don't mean to play favorites, like I'm not like that, but I am playing favorites right now because she's stunning. She's like a nice little eucalyptus color, you know? but she's not, she's leaf green. As we all know, I'm a neutral girly. All of these colors are absolutely stunning. Now that we've covered all of the basics, let's get into the actual collection. Right now I'm wearing this really nice, cute little crop top. I live in these, I am obsessed with these. They are seen in every colorway, including cement brown, which we, again, we love her. The stitching on the shirt is super basic. It's gonna show up backwards because I'm using the front of my camera, but we also have Wit's name stitched on the sleeve there as well. Again, same buttery soft fabric that you will see in the leggings. So soft, so comfortable, so durable. This collection does speak rest straight up when you see it. It's like you wanna take a cozy nap you want to curl up on the couch it's so soft even the leggings you can work out in the leggings obviously like this is meant to be worked out in however i feel like i could take a nap in them that's all so the leggings there is a lot different here okay we're used to seeing like the whole seamless vibe with wit's previous collections not with these ones okay and, and here's the thing i'm not a seams gal i'm very much a seamless girly i feel like we can all kind of agree on that however when i put these on my body um i quite literally was shook to my core i was in shambles actually Actually, okay, first of all, there are pockets. Sorry, what? I do not like pockets. I will never like pockets. However, when I put these on, I didn't even realize that they were there. So like, I guess it's fine. They are actually really flattering and cute as well. Super dainty, like they're not super out there. The stitching on the leggings is also super cute as well. As you can see, it comes down across your thigh here and then the stitching goes down all the way to your ankle. These are full length on me. I am 5'4". I get an extra small. Again, I have stuck to my original size throughout this whole collection. Just as I did her previous collections, I would say the fit is exactly the same when it comes to the logos on literally everything they are pressed on nice and dainty super cute and they match the fabric which i love that on the crop top it's also pressed on the front as well but just nice and dainty nothing too crazy you know i just feel like these leggings with this crop top and a nice new balance shoe like a nice solid dad shoe okay hold on hold on i mean like really any of these but are you kidding me 
with some high socks. Ooh, baby, yup. That's about all I have to say for that. I am currently wearing the, I really need to work on my flexibility. I am currently wearing the leaf green leggings. I am obsessed, okay? I will not be taking these off all day. Thank you so much. There are lots of seams in the leggings, but there are no front seams. Not doing our Olivia's dirty, we love that. I would also like to take a moment to talk about the long bras. Straight up, between you and me, sister to sister, I am not a long bra girly. I like short bras. I like showing off some tummy. I don't know what kind of heat this is packing, okay? But my yitties have straight up never looked so good in a bra, I swear to God. Again, we have cement brown, leaf green, and then we we also have this spicy canyon red. I love how these are like pastel vibes, like pastel colors, you know what I mean? They all go together. You can mix and match if you would like. One thing I also really like about this bra is that you can adjust it in the back so it's suitable for our itty bitties or if you're packing heat in your chest, which <clears throat> girly, I wish that I was you. I feel like it's suitable for everyone. You can also adjust the bust band as well, which is super nice. I just love the inclusivity. I truly do. Moving on to a brand new fabric that I have never, ever in my entire life seen anywhere. It's giving skims, but like different. It's thick. It's cozy, it's comfy. She's not itchy, which is nice because that was my main concern like when I first saw this. I was like, girly, am I gonna be itching up a storm? Absolutely not. So cozy, so comfy. This is the new eyelash material. Like, I seriously don't think I've seen this literally anywhere. It feels like a blanket. It actually feels like I'm wearing a blanket. If this came in leggings, I honestly don't know if I could do it because it's really thick. It's so perfect for shorts. And then there is also a matching bra as well that has straps. The straps aren't adjustable, which I do wish that they were adjustable, but that's only because I have itty bitty titties. It is what it is, but same fabric goes for the top and the bottom. I also just want to say this is so incredibly stretchy. I was incredibly shook when I put this on my body. I won't lie to you. The waistband is nice and thick. As you can see, it's double lined here, so it's, it's going to keep you in. I just feel like if you're wanting to lounge at home, but you're wanting to look cozy, this is the way to be, you know, this is the way to be. We also have her in Canyon Red. Red, along with my girl leaf green so we got we got options here the one thing i will say is she is a little staticky okay i do suggest getting static spray or like something to get rid of the static because like my hair is doobie sticking to this eyelash fur and i don't know what's going on here colorways also apply to the bras as well so again we have the leaf green in the bra and then we have the canyon red in the bra i just think it's adorable that these are cute little bandeau bras i feel like the bandeau bra is whitney's favorite bra she always wears it it's just like a staple whenever i see bandeau bra i think of wit the fact that she made a cozy little like bandeau bra that's adorable on the back here there is a little tag that has the gymshark logo and says whitney's name which then on the straps it says Gymshark, so cute. I would not go out bust in a workout in these. I won't lie, if you do do that, I, I, I don't know what to say. I mean, to each their own, I will never judge. However, I just don't think it's a suitable workout outfit. This is strictly for resting, lounging in. As I said before, this collection speaks rest day vibes and we absolutely love that because we are in our rest day era. Last piece I do wanna show you guys is the skylight white zip up. It gives the coziest, most warmest vibes. I just, I can't even, I can't even express to you guys what this jacket means to me. It goes with every single piece in this collection. All the mix and match vibes, if you wish. This also comes in the cement brown as well, which I have been eyeing up and I'm like, you know what? I think I need that one as well. If you wanna go eyelash on eyelash on eyelash, you can do so. If you wanna go eyelash on buttery soft fabric with eyelash, you can also do so. Absolutely obsessed. And then on the back of the jacket is the same thing with the bras. There's just a little tag there that says Wit's name and then the Gymshark logo. All of these colors, including black and pressed petal pink, will be launching as well tomorrow, so stay tuned for that. I'm just still blown away at how well this collection was done, and extremely bittersweet because I feel like Whitney's come so far with these collections, and I just love how much time and effort that she has put into designing these. And I'm just so blessed to be representing activewear that has been created by such a wonderful human. I do have a link with Gymshark that you can shop through. It is in my Instagram bio along with, I will leave it down below for you. If you do shop through my bio, please, please, please send me your order confirmations to my email, which I will also leave below. And I will enter you into the January giveaway. I will be picking two winners I've decided for January in honor of Whitney's new collection. Make sure you set your alarms. Don't know if this is gonna be restocked you're better off to get it while it's here. I would hate for you to miss out, but as always, thank you guys so much for the love and support, and I will see you in the next video.